Stipe Miocic has survived and conquered Francis Ngannou tonight. He will be the most decorated heavyweight champion in UFC history. Stipe exacts his revenge! Francis Ngannou is coming! Looks physically fantastic coming into this fight. We're gonna learn what lessons he took from that fight against heavyweight champion of the world, Stipe Miocic. Oh, Lewis with the first real crack. Oh, Derek Lewis with the switch kick up high. Since Derek Lewis attacks the body, but Derek Lewis with a flurry less than two minutes here to go. For the winner by unanimous decision, Derek the Black Beast Lewis. So Derek Lewis, your winner by decision tonight. Never before has a UFC light heavyweight champion moved up to challenge the active heavyweight champion. That is our reality here and now. And DC pops him a couple of times. Oh! oh big one, two from Cormier! Oh! oh he Cormier hurt knocks me into down! It's out! History! Oh. UFC history! Daniel Cormier! Daniel Cormier is the UFC heavyweight champion! What an incredible two years it's been for Francis Ngannou since he fought and beat Curtis Blades. Tonight is about rediscovering the form that got all of our tongues wagging and proving to his fans, Dan, he is still a threat and a man to get behind. He is absolutely a threat to anybody in this division. It doesn't matter what to do. Oh! He's getting my opponents to raise Over the top with the right hand! Does Blaze recovery still wobbly on his feet? Mark Goddard's taking a closer look. Ngannou's powering in. Oh, this there is bad is. news. That's what? it. Francis Ngannou wow. wins in Beijing double quick. What a power shot over the top from Francis Ngannou. He's back. About a year ago, he challenged Stipe Miocic for the UFC heavyweight title. He's coming off a huge win over Curtis Blades in November. Tonight, he draws Cain Velazquez, and he's excited to test his hands against one of the best to ever do it. Much has been made of Velazquez's injuries, but in terms of his body, he's never felt more confident in it. Oh, oh he got hurt. Velazquez is That's hurt. It. That's Ngannou it. closes the show. Oh, my goodness Just like that, gracious. Francis Ngannou has knocked out Cain Velazquez. Wow. Well, Francis Ngannou dusted Curtis Blades in 45 seconds back in November. Wow. 26 seconds tonight. Incredible. This guy is powerful. He just literally walked through and just floored it. Absolutely floored it. I promise you, guy, I'm back. As I said before, I'm back. And you're going to see me around. All right, here we go. They were initially slated to fight at UFC 215 in Edmonton back in 2017. Two years later, it shall be done. Junior Sagano Dos Santos has been the man at the top of the heat. Francis Ngannou hoping to eventually hit that rarefied air. Oh, oh man, they sting. And I'm just sitting here. I'm like tense. Oh, oh my God. Oh! oh huge oh, right from Ngannou. Dos Santos in a world of pain. Oh, Francis what? Ngannou. Too much for JDS tonight. Absolutely sensational. And if he is not the scariest power puncher to have ever touched down on that canvas, I'll take your other nominations. <laughs> he said that Mike Tyson is his hero. Well, he's the Mike Tyson of mixed martial arts. Yes. And the former UFC heavyweight champion, Stipe Miocic, making the walk here tonight. He's been very dismissive of DC's first effort against him. He has called it fluky, he has invoked the word lottery, and he can put all of that to bed in a large way tonight by getting this series even at one. Oh, again. Oh, big shot. And a good Stupid. right hand. This is a great round for the former champion. Best round so far for Steve. For sure, look at that. Moving slick. Yep. DC knows he's oh! feeling it. Oh! Those are. Uh, oh, hurt. now a right hurt. hand up top. Oh, no. oh, man, he's in hurt. trouble. Oh, he's DC hurt. in a world of hurt. trouble. He is down. Oh, that's it. Steve exactly is up down. Wow. Mia Chich is getting the belt back. Wow. Cleveland, Ohio, Stipe Miocic waited more than a year, and once again, the heavyweight division belongs to him. He fought Stipe for the heavyweight title. It was January of 2018. We'll see if he can potentially secure another title shot with a win here tonight.
Early inside leg kick is there for Biggie Boy. Oh! Oh! oh that's it. It's over. Rosenstrike is out! Whoa! In Ganu! Out bad! Out cold. Holy smokes! So Francis Ngannou with his fourth consecutive vicious first Holy round knockout. Cow. See, that's what we're talking about. You can't make any mistakes. You can't be there when the punches land. He's too powerful. Francis Ngannou's next level, man. Oh, it's unbelievable. He blitzes you. And once he gets his hands on these guys, they just go out. He's so big, he's so powerful, he's so explosive that you cannot withstand the, the, the rush. And, and I mean, he put Biggie Boy out bad. He became the champion in 2016 with a knockout in Brazil of Fabricio Verdum. And now he enters the octagon after that win over DC as a credential two-time UFC heavyweight champion. Credential two-time UFC heavyweight champion who's defended the title more than any man in history. Act three is upon us. The challenger Cormier is in blue. Stipe is in the black and gold, befitting a champion. Here we go, folks. Strong low kick. Oh, oh switch that right after left. that lands. Oh, that's a big left hook from Miocic, Joe. Oh, big right from Miocic. Cormier goes down late in the round. DK hits so hard. Oh. Stipe's hands are just looking so heavy in this matchup. Oh, good right hand. Big right hand by Stipe. And a beautiful one by DC as well. Oh. Oh. Huge right from me, Oh, again. And still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. And he stands right now as the greatest UFC heavyweight of all time. Without a doubt on paper, he's accomplished more than any man that has ever fought in this division.